The Q, the Q angle test is used to determine whether a patient has normal Q angles. To perform the test, a subject will lie supine with the hips and knees extended. The performer will, will identify the anterior superior iliac spines, midpoint of the patella, and tibial tubercle. <clears throat> then they will strike a line from the anterior superior iliac spines to the middle, to the middle of the patella and from the tibial tubercle to the midpoint of the patella. Next, they'll place a goniometer on the knee so that the axis is over the midpoint of the patella, the proximal arm is over the line to the anterior superior iliac spines, and the distal arm is over the line to the tibial tubercle. The resulting angle is the Q angle. Positive findings, positive findings should result in a norm, but so greater angles or smaller angles are indicative of patellofemoral pathology.